paper that was able to detect in real time the metals uh, produced by firework emissions. Uh, this was very early in the development of the aerosol time of flight mass spectrometer, which is a laser ablation single particle instrument. And it demonstrated the great advantage of that type of new technique where you can uh, directly see sudden um, increases in the levels of pollution, uh, such as toxic metal particles from fireworks. Normally, you'd have to collect the sample onto a filter for a few hours, take it and analyze it, and you would just get an average concentration of the metal particles in the air over a few hours. But that instrument can detect multiple particles per second. So you're getting real-time, rapid, um, direct measurements of what is changing in the atmosphere. Fireworks are a source of transition metals uh, to the atmosphere and those can be toxic but they also catalyze important chemical reactions in the atmosphere and other types of particles in the atmosphere such as metals found in mineral dust from the deserts also catalyze uh, important chemical reactions. They can change the amount of pollution in the atmosphere, they can change the types of chemicals that are present. Uh, transition metals, uh, for example, oxidize um, sulfur dioxide into sulfate, creating sulfuric acid, which is a major form of air pollution uh, in the atmosphere.